The 2024 WNBA Round 1 playoffs delivered a thrilling matchup with all higher seeds sweeping their series. Hi, and welcome to Davis Sports Report. If you haven't done so already, please subscribe to help us grow the channel and turn on notification to be updated as we drop new content. So let's recap the WNBA's playoffs first round games and standout moments. The playoffs kicked off with the New York Liberty facing the Atlanta Dream. The Liberty dominated the Dream in game one, winning 83-69. Brianna Stewart led with 20 points and 11 rebounds, while Sabrina Unescu provided 17 points and five assists. And the standout player in game one was Leone Fiebisch, who erupted for 21 points. The Dream tried to fight back in game two, leading by as many as five points at halftime. The Liberty surged in the second half, ultimately winning 91-82, with Sabrina exploding for 36 points, backed by Jonquil Jones' 20 points and 13 rebounds. Atlanta Alicia Gray posted 26 points, but it wasn't enough for the upset, and the New York Liberty secured the sweep. In the second matchup, the Lynx took a commanding 102-95 win in Game 1, led by Nafisa Collier's career-high 38 points, despite the Mercury's strong fourth quarter comeback, sparked by Natasha Cloud's 33 points, Minnesota held on to secure game one. In game two, the Lynx continued their dominance, securing the sweep 101 to 88 behind the Fisa Collier's once again career high 42 points, while also showing off Minnesota's defensive dominance. And we swing back to the East where Connecticut Sun would face off against Indiana Fever. In the matchup between the Sun and the Fever, Connecticut dominated game one with an 83-69 win. Alyssa Thomas led the way while Marina Mayberry made a huge impact, setting a playoff record for most points off the bench, 27. The fever led by rookie Caitlin Clark struggled with the Suns defense, particularly the Warner Bonner's defense on Caitlin Clark. The Fever's Kelsey Mitchell had a strong showing in Game 1 with 21 points. In Game 2, we would see the Fever's adjust to Indiana's defense with its top three players all putting up double-digit points to make up for the poor showing in Game 1. Led by Caitlin Clark's 25 points and 9 assists, Aaliyah Boston's double-double of 16 points and 19 rebounds, and Kelsey Mitchell's 17 points would go on to take the lead with 2 minutes and 5 seconds left in the game. The Suns' experience, depth, and defensive prowess proved too much for the young Indiana Fever squad. The Suns would go on to escape game two, 87-81, and secure the series sweep. And back out west, we would find the Las Vegas Aces facing off against the Seattle Storm. The Aces, led by unanimous MVP Asia Wilson, got off to a surprisingly slow start. Kelsey Mitchell logged just two points in game one. Asia did finally show up in the second half of the game, finishing with 21 points to secure game one, 78-67. Seattle star Jewel Lloyd was a no-show in both game one, putting up six points, and in game two, putting up nine points. But alas, the Aces' depth contributing heavily in scoring, rebounding, and experience kept the Storm from mounting any serious challenge and the Aces would go on to sweep its series as well, joining the other top-seeded teams. While the higher-seeded teams advance without dropping a game, one surprising twist is that the Aces and the Liberty, last year's championship matchup, will now meet each other in the semifinals instead of potentially facing off in the finals. This outcome is due to structural changes in the WNBA playoff format, with the teams now reseeded after the first round, setting the stage for a highly anticipated matchup between the two powerhouse teams. Fans can expect an intense matchup, especially since the Liberty won all three regular season encounters against the Aces. Both teams have star-studded rosters, with 2023 MVP Brianna Stewart, Sabrina Unescu, and Jonquil Jones leading New York, while this year's MVP Asia Wilson, Chelsea Gray, and Kelsey Plum anchor the Las Vegas Aces. The stakes have never been higher, with both teams eager to prove they belong in the championship series. Meanwhile, Connecticut Sun will face off against the league's best defensive team, Minnesota Lynx, both advancing to the semifinals after strong performances. Can the Minnesota Lynx, with an eye on the spot in the finals, 
riding a Fisa Collie past the Connecticut Suns, or will the sum of the Suns part, Dewana Bonner, Alyssa Thomas, Dijanae Carrington, and new addition Marina Mayberry be the end of the Minnesota Lynx magical season? With the best of five format, the competition will intensify and all eyes will be on these teams and how they adjust and adapt for the upcoming battles. As always, thank you guys for watching. Comment, like, subscribe, and join us as we stream the WNBA semifinals competition kicking off today. The first game is at 3 p.m.